Today we'll be making marbled rye bread. All the ingredients and measurements will be down below. To your mixer bowl, add in three cups of bread flour, one and a half cup of rye flour, salt, and sugar. Give it a quick mix and we'll add in our caraway seeds, oil, then add in the yeast, and then last we'll add in our water. Now bring it over to your stand mixer and let it mix for 8 minutes. Once fully incorporated and your dough is elastic and passes the window pane test, then we're ready and we can set it aside. Now we'll take out our dough and divide it into two pieces. One dough will be our plain dough and the other one will be our dark dough. Place the first dough back into the mixing bowl and we'll use it in just a minute. The second dough will be our plain dough, so just place it into a greased bowl and cover it. Now back to our mixing bowl for our dark dough. We'll add in three tablespoons cocoa powder to give it a nice color. We'll also add in our molasses. Now bringing it back to the stand mixer, let it mix and knead until fully incorporated. This should take about 3 minutes. Once it's mixed like this, we'll take it out and place it into a greased bowl just like our first dough and cover it. Let both doughs rise for 1 hour. Once ready, we'll take our plain dough first and roll it flat. Then repeat this process for your dark dough. Then carefully stack your dark dough onto your plain dough then gently flatten it and then we'll roll it into a log. If you find that your dough is too sticky, use a bench scraper or gently flour your surface. Make sure to pinch your seams and place the dough seam down into your greased pan. Cover it and let it rest for another hour. Now we're ready to bake. Bake at 350 for about 40 to 45 minutes. Let your bread cool completely before slicing. And there you have it, your beautiful marble dry bread. Enjoy!